Hello everybody, welcome back to Ultima Underworld, the Stygian Abyss, and we were down inside the spiral, alright, down here, I'm going to explore around this area here, um, down on the actual floor of the spiral, and see if there's anything worth exploring down here, so while I do that, I'm probably going to uh, if I don't come across anything I will just edit it out and I will see you back here at the door and we'll make our way back up the spiral again so I will see you then Alright. Excellent dagger. And being that my skills are in blades are higher than my skills in axes. And yeah, my sword skills are three, my axe skills are two. So this is a good swap out. Excellent leather leggings. Alright, looks like I may get entirely refitted out here while we're down here. Good, 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 good. Ah, sorry, serviceable. I was going, what happened? They were excellent a second ago. Still thinking about that dagger. Alright, and onward. What the hell? Headless. even hit this thing. Good grief. Oh, good lord. Well, that was some kind of a zomboid type monster. Um, that definitely ate me alive. Alrighty. Well, we're back up full on our health and all. Where are we at? Full wide awake second day at dawn you know that's just bizarre all right first level let's get the uh, light spell going again and since we're in this area we might as well go visit the shrine 
and do a little chanting. Let's see if we can get our light spell going again. There we go. Get the healing back up. Alright, and I'm going to go back over here, visit the shrine, and uh, level up. And then maybe that headless won't be quite so blasted tough. And I'll see you over there at the shrine. Okay, and we have reached the shrine. Um, let's see. I think we're going to use at least Mantra of Courage. Some raw. We're going to use some raw to start off with. Because we could definitely use a little bit more skill in our combat. So. Some raw. Axe, defense, and mace. Okay. Let's take another look here, see what we have. Axe is now a four, so we definitely need to swap out our axe. Defense is an eight. Mace is a two. Alright, what other skills do we have? Missile, mana, lore, casting. Hmm, why don't we try um, our magic skills one more time? What was the chant for that? Magic is Mu Om. So let's see if we really did gain another level. Mu. Um, we did two levels of lore for that's what's that worth? Um, doesn't say what level we are. Hmm. Well, just for giggles. We'll use the last mantra. Um, ka. Just to see whether or not um, it's going to let us level again. Don't think that it shall. Um, ka. Oh, it did. Alright, acrobat, swimming, traps, and acrobat. Huh. Interesting, very interesting. So how many times is it going to let us do this? Let's see, was it Sumra? Okay, so it gave us three levels. That is most peculiar. I would not have... Uh... Yeah, Paladin, I think that's the sixth level. Maybe I never... Um came and leveled up after the fourth level. If so, what a shame. Okay. So. We are going to go back down to... Nope. While we're up here, let's go visit the Grey Goblins. I'm going to travel over there and see whether or not um, either of the spiders I killed were the ones that they were having trouble with. So I will meet you over there at the entrance to their home as I fall in the water again. We'll see you over there. Alright, and we are here approaching the home of the Grey Goblins. So let's see if one of them will open the door for us. Ho, oh, Narlo, why are you here again? Uh, canst thou open this portcullis? Well, you be careful, mind your manners, on you go. 
Thank thee for the advice. All right. Now, we need to go speak to the king. Is that Wretched All, maybe? Is that his name? I think so. Um, okay, he's not anyone I need to talk to. Let's talk to his Wretched All's wife first. Last time, it was a situation where you had to talk to her to get the permission. So let's take a look and see if that's still the same case. Hmm. How did you get out? I thought I had you closed up inside a cave. Inside your little house there. <sighs> I have given thee permission to talk to my husband, and that is enough of my time for thee to waste. Speak to me no more. Okay. I don't have to tell me twice, lady. I can get enough drama at home. I don't need any of yours. Let us go shut the door right quick so that the king does not escape or wander out or whatever you wish to call it. Okay. And he should. There he is. Will you talk to me about the thing? Only so much of my time canst thou waste. Hast no one else to bother. Alright, so maybe it wasn't the king that I was talking to that gave me the, uh... Gave me the spider problem. Let's see if I can find another named... Goblin around here somewhere. Or perhaps one of the unnamed goblins. Okay, it's definitely not gonna be wretched all. Canst thou tell me of thy race, the Grey Goblins? Grey Goblins, Grey Goblins. What of the Grey Goblins? Uh, you look for a powerful group, came to the right place. I thank thee for thy time. Okay, let's look at our map. Hmm. That's where the king is. That's the storeroom. Well, let's wander over there to the west. And see if anybody knows this somebody in many eyes. I can't remember her first name. Started with an N. But supposedly the spider that was giving them so much trouble. Hello, it's funny looking person again. Can thou tell me the race, the goblins? Grey goblins, grey goblins, ugly and humans, not related to us, blah, 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 blah. What are the grey goblins? Uh, grey goblins look up to us, you come to the right place. Okay, I thank thee for that time. Well, this is a puzzler. Mellow Goblin, Brick Wall, Just hold still for God's sake, Jcar, there we go, we finally found one with a name, let's see if we can speak to him, 
Hey, who this? What you do? Um, I have come to admire the architectural splendor of the people's settlement. What you say? You like to explore, walk around? Don't explore too careful. Could end up someplace you'd not want to be. I've seen that happen. Hee <laughs> hee. Um, what dost thou mean? Us greys, we never do it on purpose. Ha <laughs> ha. But in night, I sometimes... I hear sometimes scream and then splash. Sometimes splash and then scream. Then in the morning, one of us not here. Dangerous privy it is there. I watch out if I were you. Hee <laughs> hee. Um, and they are never heard from again? That right. Hee <laughs> hee. Splash. Aye. Gone, gone, gone. Hee <laughs> hee. You be careful, you. If any still alive from Splash, I bet they not too happy. You be on your toes. Hmm, thank you. I will be. Alright, so that is a privy over there. I'm definitely not going to uh, get too close to it in case Jakar here um, decides he has a good sense of humor. Alright, I think we've wasted enough time talking to these guys. They are apparently not going to talk to me about that spider anymore. And I will have to go back and look at the tape and see if I can figure out who the heck it was that talked to me about it in the first place. Is there anyone else to talk to around these parts? Let's see. You want to talk about anything? Ebb. Oh. Ho, oh, Narlo, why are you here again? I am continuing my journey. You have a nice journey then. Alright. So, that was... Less than useful. Right there's the collapsed stairs. That's the healing thing. I don't think there are any more goblins over that way, so... Alright. I said I will go back, I will see who it was that told me about the spiders in the first place and see if I can find them again. Meanwhile, I'm going to travel right over here to the down staircase. Um, someone commented that there was a, uh, a key that I had passed there. I think it's a duplicate of the gray one that I have, but uh, it's still worth picking up just to find out and to be sure. So I'm going to head over there, and I'll meet you over there. Okay, we're back over here at the uh, downstairs, downward stairs, and our light has burned out yet again. Let's get the torch going. I'm wondering if the duration's random, because sometimes it seems to last forever, other times it does not seem to last that long at all. Get the healing spell back up. <sighs> Click on the right spot. There you go. Alright, can we pick that key up? We can. I'm going to drop it in the box. And yeah, see, it It seems to have stacked with the other one, but we'll hang on to it just in case or until I don't have enough weight allowance left, at which point um, I'll throw it away along with that torch that keeps hanging off my shoulder that I keep forgetting to drop. All right, we're back on the second floor. I'm going to uh, go up here, make a quick loop around this little loop here. I think it just loops around, but we'll go up and be sure. So we can finish off that part of the map and not have to sit there and wonder about it any longer. So let's quickly go up and loop around. see where that goes. A 
Whoops. Okay. Another one of those acid spitting poison binding little MFs. Come on. At least it doesn't seem to be hitting us at all. Okay, we shook a little bit just then. Excellent, good. Is that the only one? Make sure there's not anything behind us. Huh. Did I go the correct direction? May not have done that either. Okay, I did, and it just looped around, so that's where we'll stop for this time when I come back. Um, hmm, I don't know whether it'd go up against that headless again or not, or perhaps just travel down. I think I'll leave the headless alone for the moment, and we'll come back over here past where Mr. Blueprints is and see if we can't discover what's on down this passage over here. So that's where we'll leave it for tonight. Um, thank y'all for watching. And let's see, root of all evil. Past Mr. Blueprints. And we'll see you next time. Thank you much.